A very long time ago, before there were people on the earth, there were animals and birds, but they were much larger than they are now. And there was no sun in the sky, only the moon and the stars. Now one day, a terrible fight broke out between Dinwan the emu and Broga the crane. Tempers frayed, they were shrieking and screaming, feathers flew everywhere. It hurled up. In her rage, Rolga ran over to Dinwan's nest, grabbed one of her eggs, and hurled it up into the heavens. Up it went, and it landed on a huge pile of firewood. It cracked, and the yellow yolk went all over the firewood, causing it to burst into flames. Below, the world was suddenly lit up by this blaze. And the animals that had lived in the half-light were dazzled by the fiery glow. The cloud man saw how beautiful the earth looked under this fiery blaze. I will make a fire every day, he said, so day will never be dark again. At night, while the fire burned out, he set off into the forest to collect all the firewood he could. When the heat was high enough, he sent the morning star to warn those on earth that the fire would soon be lit, bringing the rosy pinks of dawn with her. Though, though the morning star shone brightly, it was not enough. Those who slept did not see the day arrive. Instead, the spirits decided they needed a noise loud enough to wake the sleeping people. For a long time, they debated over what the noise should be. Then one morning, they heard the laughter of the kookaburra ringing through the air. That is exactly the noise we need, they agreed. It will wake an even the deepest sleeper. And so they instructed kookaburra that every morning, as the morning star faded, he must laugh his loudest laugh. If he did not, the sunfire would go out plunging the earth into half-light once more. Proud Kookaburra did not fail, and to this day he still laughs the loudest in the hour just before dawn. If you enjoy these stories, please hit like and subscribe, and if there is a story you would like to hear, please mention it in the comments below. Thank you.